We've passed on all we know. A thousand generations live in you now. But this is your fight. Hey guys, Andy Kid here. Um, sorry it took me so long to get this up. Um, saw it about a week ago or so uh, now. Um, just uh, been one heck of a week uh, with Christmas and work and stuff. Um, today was actually one of my favorite first days off in what feels like forever. Anyway, uh, Star Wars Rise of Skywalker. What do I think? I liked it. All right, um, I like it even as you know, um, out of the uh, the trilogy, out of the three um, with Ray, Finn, and them. I have to say it's the best of the three in my opinion, but it still is a, It's still like really low on my list um, of Star Wars movies. I'm gonna have to say it's it's like below. It's a, it made it above uh, Solo. It made it above. Uh, it's a hard pick for me between it and Rogue One, um, but it's still original trilogy. To, uh, Revenge of the Sith, and then Phantom Menace, and then Attack of the Clones, or, or Rogue One and it, and Attack of the Clones, and Solo, and, and the other two. It's it, it's still pretty low on the list. Um, it was good. Um, the answer, I'm trying to do no spoilers, which is some movies, it's really hard to do that, but to explain why, what things I did like and not. Um, I plan to do watch it again when I can, so hopefully I can do a, a bit more of another deeper review with some spoilers, and I will, don't worry, I will label it, you know, spoilers or anything, so if you haven't seen it by that point. Um, but there were some good things. A lot of things were answered. A lot of things were that people have been uh, talking about and, or, or asking questions about. But at the same time, some of them, I, I, I liked some of them. I liked where uh, some of the answers, I liked some things and a lot of things. And it was, the story was pretty good and, and, and other things. Um, but it, it uh, the others seemed like cop-outs, um, like Snoke's identity. You finally learn that. It's a bit of a spoiler. I'm not going to tell you who he is or where he came from or anything like that. Um, but you learn it, and it was kind of a cop out. Honestly, I think they could have done better. Um, it just seemed like a last minute. Well, let's just do this. Um, Ray's background is an interesting twist. It's an interesting thing. It's definitely, definitely something I wouldn't have thought of. Um, so uh, I, I gave I, perks to that. Um, but in the same time, uh, why it's called Rise of Skywalker? Uh, uh, I can only guess at one one point of it, which I can't say because of, it's a spoiler, major spoiler, but like it's at the end of the movie. Once you see it, if you haven't seen it yet, you'll know what I'm talking about. The, that that was stupid. It did cater uh, a little bit. To, 
it wasn't as political as Last Jedi, which when I watch a movie, I don't want any. I mean, if it's something and it's very little, it's like, eh, you know, and if as long as it doesn't seem forced, um, like some people are bitching about this uh, one aspect of it. I'm not going to tell you where it is or when it is or what it's for, but there's a celebration moment uh, and there's two girls that kiss in the background. It's a very quick thing. It's not a big deal. It happens. It's it, it's a real thing. You know, you're, it's something you're going to see at the mall. You're going to see two girls kissing. You're see two, you know, lesbians exist. But so that's not that big of a deal. Um, but when it's the whole like the whole casino planet and rich people are bad, all all that crap, it, 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 that that's not needed. Um, so it wasn't too bad in that sense. There were multiple breathtaking moments. I was on the edge of my seat multiple moments. There was others that were like, oh, and you know, like like I can't believe that just happened. And I really hope that didn't, that's not true. I really hope that doesn't mean what I think it means, all this other stuff. It's really good. It was really fun. It was a great movie in that sense. I think, though, this movie should have been Last Jedi. Honestly, I think they should change some stuff, and, and, and Last Jedi should have been this should have been the middle movie. While it had some action, um, it was mostly a storytelling part, a movie. It was kind of like Empire, in between, for Empire, what, it's, it's imp, it feels like an Empire movie, like Empire Strikes Back, so in between, say, like, the Two Towers and Lord of the Rings, they're mostly storytelling and setting up stuff. I feel like this movie should have been that. Um, and then there should have been another one. But since last, they didn't do it that way. This one kind of tied up a lot of loose ends. Um, I have my grievances with them, and I, like I said, I'm going to go try and watch it again. I'm going to then do a spoiler review with this, so I can talk about it deeper. Sorry, deeper detail without giving away key details about what happens and stuff like that. Um, any major spoilers? Like I said, it's a hard movie to do with. I'm, so I'm trying my best. I do recommend seeing it when you get a chance if you haven't already. If you're one of those people who are putting off seeing Star Wars because of The Last Jedi, um, this movie isn't as good as the originals, but it is leaps and bounds better than The Last Jedi, in my opinion. Um, honestly, if they did, I, I, I don't think they could have done worse than The Last Jedi. So that's definitely something to consider if you haven't seen it already. If you're going to do something to the holidays... Go and see it. It's really it was a it was a decent movie. It was pretty good. Um, so I hope that answers any questions of whether you should go or not. Um, okay. Um, all right, guys. Well, that's all I have to say without spoiling anything. It was really hard. I know I rambled a little bit and it seemed like bull crap, but I'm just trying to to tell you it's a decent movie without spoiling major things. Like I said, again, I'm going to do a spoiler review. Um, I think that's everything, so have a good holiday, um, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, whatever you celebrate, um, remember to hit that notification button and the subscription button, if there's a movie you guys are iffy on, let me know, I will go see it, and uh, if I can, I I mean, if I when, if I have the time, I'll go see it before it leaves the theaters, I'll put a review on it, same with video games, anything like that, catch you guys next time. It beats for you, so listen close Hear my thoughts in every note oh, oh. Make me your yeah. radio <laughs> And turn me up when you feel low This melody was meant for you right Sing there. along to my stereo Two class heroes, baby if I was just another dusty record on the shelf Would you blow me off and play me like everybody else? If I asked you to scratch my back, could you manage that? Like if we had chicken travel, I can handle that